What's up guys welcome back to 4x4 Jumpman and today we're gonna do some unboxing of the Steady Work Light. So I've chosen this brand for my Ford Ranger build because it's got good reputation and it's great quality and it looks good. Steady is an Australian brand and it was founded in 2013 out of the small warehouse in Melbourne, Australia. So the light I got is the ST3301 Pro 4.6 inch 2 LED work light. So I'll be putting this on the left side of my roof rack so I can see the side when I'm camping. So this light has a waterproof rating of IP68 and it's also got 2 year warranty. This work light has been designed to offer a high volume of light in the mid-range with excellent visibility on the road shoulders. I've chosen the Pro work light because it's got a really high beam for any small or large space. So as soon as you open the box you get to see the instruction pamphlet and it's got all the photos of all the accessories and lights on the front. This light is built to withstand dust ingression and long periods of water immersion. The mounting bracket is aluminium but the bolts and fittings are stainless steel. What I like about this, it's got the two colored side caps which is orange and you can also change it to grey which is also included. This has two flood reflector distribution as well as a coordinated color temperature of up to 56,000 K. Excellent color contrast. The lens has about 250 times the impact resistant strength of glass and 30 times stronger than acrylic polycarbonate. It also has the waterproof Dutch DT connector. The all new flood reflector design minimizes light scatter on the vertical axis, allowing for a more concentrated illumination. This means that there is more light where it matters most. The half width beam angle of 45 degrees allow for a range of rotations, achieving an excellent light coverage. It has the male and female Dutch connectors. This just looks so good and looks very solid. The pamphlet has all the instructions on how to easily install it. So once I get all the parts to install this light, I'll be making a separate video on how to install the lights, including all the harnesses. This has an operating voltage of a 10 to 45 volts DC. And this only weighs 600 grams. Now I'll demonstrate on how to connect the bolts together with the mounts. Just remember when you are buying these lights, you also need to get the wiring kit loom harness and it depends if you want them high beam triggered or not. The one that I got, I didn't get the high beam triggered ones. Because I wanted the work light to run separately so I can turn it on and off whenever I want. So when you buy a work light you're also going to need a wiring harness 
so I've got the LED work light wiring kit loom harness which is not high beam triggered so this one's already fully assembled it contains everything you need to get your lights connected it's got the button on and off switch and it's also got the relay which is rated to 40A so you can use the one wiring kit to connect several lights bars to the one wiring loom it's a total of 4.8 meters of wiring so 2.8 meters of cabling from relay to switch 2 meters cabling from light connectors to relay we got the 12 volt DC 30A rated fuse kit and it's also UV rated insulation it's also got the instructions on how to wire your light I'm not really a fan of the red switch so I've ordered the square switch which is from Steady also here is an example of how I would be mounting it I haven't fully installed it yet I just wanted to see what it looks like so it's not fully wired yet it looks really nice and it fits right under my awning I can swivel it from left to right and up and down to get light anywhere I want comment below on what you think of the work light would you get one or would you get something else and if you did get one where would you install it in your four-wheel drive and what would you use it for if you like this video please like and subscribe and i'll see you on the next one peace